Given the following C++ code, select the corresponding output given the base address of the node on the data heap is this address that ends in 7 echo 0. So we see that we start with a long unsigned integer. The long unsigned integer is 64 bits or it's 8 bytes. Double, we have another one that's 64 and 8. For a float, it's 32, so it's single precision, and this is 4, and the int here is 32 and 4. We have a valid member initialization list. We see that puts them in the correct order. So now we have a method print node values. We see that in main, we call node 1 and then do print node values. So first we print this. This is a keyword that corresponds to the base address of the class on the data heap. So that's going to be 7 echo 0. Next, we print out the long unsigned integer, which is 445. And it's located at the same location on the data heap. We have to add 8 bytes to the long unsigned integer, and then we allocate the double, which is going to be 7 echo 8. Then we have to go to the float. So the float is going to be negative 7.78. And now what's going to happen is we add 8, because 8 is the same size of the double. So now we go to 7f0, and then we do the integer. The integer is negative 22, and to get to the address of the float, we have to add 4, because that's the 4 bytes. To, start to get to the address of the integer, we have to add 4 bytes, because we have to skip past the float. So now we go in here, and now we check the solutions. A doesn't match. B, 0, E8, F0, F4. That is correct. Therefore, the correct answer is B.